So, hi Florian, great to have met you here at Unleash Conference in Paris. I mean, it was my we have, pleasure. We have the Eiffel Tower in the background, uh, and nice I think we have a, have a really good time here. Um, maybe can you introduce yourself? Yeah, hey everybody, I'm uh, Florian Schroth, I'm uh, head of HR marketing and recruitment at uh, Medbase, a uh, 360 degree um, medical provider in Switzerland. I mean, you're partnering with that uh, with us at Clever Connect. I think what would be interesting to maybe explain, because I know that you have uh, joined Medbase just a couple a of months ago, a year ago more or less. Um, so, what is the situation that you have found when you joined Medbase, and what kind of, um, let's say, strategies have you decided to follow to, I would say, modernize your recruitment yeah. at Medbase? Okay, I would say, um, yeah, um, challenges or problems are pretty comparable um, to other companies. Um, demographic change, new demands, um, labor shortage for sure, but um, if you take a deeper view it's more or less very special because um, target groups that we are um, tackling or try to attract are um, medicals and pharmacists um, more or less, some more profiles for sure. And when you take a few at the market, and that what we did first is a very analytical view on the labor market, on the change in demands uh, of our target groups and on our numbers as well, for sure, we saw, hey, okay, there are just three to five job seekers um, on job platforms um, for vacancy in our job profiles. That means there are even less job seekers for MedBase, for yes. sure. Yes. And that's a huge challenge. Okay. So what we did is um, we had a lot of conversations with people working for us in the job profiles, with the management, with the recruiters as well. And we decided to go very consequent new ways. So maybe before you say what kind of new ways you decided to uh, follow, um, what has been working well when you joined MedBase and what has not been working so well? Mm -hmm. I would say the best thing at MedBase is the commitment. The commitment of the management, the commitment of our employees and the commitment in HR um, to find solutions. And that's the best thing that could happen. Uh, what was not working well are the processes or the systems. And I would say that's pretty good known for most companies. And um, so I, I understand like there was a very strong uh, scarcity of, uh, of, of, I would say, talent on the market, so yeah. of, of supply for your, your open yeah. roles. Um, so um, what new strategy have you now decided to implement? And maybe you can uh, explain that very concrete and, and some concrete actions that you've taken since joining MedBase. I try to. Yeah, uh, as we recognized, there are not enough applicants uh, for our vacancies anymore. Uh, we decided to have um, not an applicant management in recruitment anymore, but um, more focusing on leads, getting easily in contact with us um, as a company, uh, with the relevant people in the company and uh, converting the leads into candidates. Let's say it's kind of lead business and relationship management. Well, we, we know about that at, uh, at Clever Connect. <laughs> I think so. <laughs> Okay, but I think that the challenge is always when you you know want to uh, follow a new strategy is the execution behind it. Sure. <laughs> so how have you made sure that the whole organization is actually also ready for that shift to being able to you know move to a new mindset of not thinking so much about applicants anymore, but more about leads, like you mentioned, and really following up on those leads mm. to increase your conversion uh, and you know hire more people at the end of the day. Yeah. I would say uh, AI is the solution for everything. No, just kidding. Um, <laughs> um, to be honest, um, what we thought is, okay, we got to be more personalized. Therefore, we need automation. We need time for our recruiters, for personal relationship building, and we need a good information management, good information work for, uh, workflows. That means, um, as I said before, we don't need a 
an applicant management management system. We need a system with good information workflows because if you have a shortage on the labor market, uh, the individual context is relevant. What does that mean? Uh, for us, means um, that we don't do in the first step the general employer branding as we know it with a lot of promises, visions, etc. What we try to build is kind of information workflows where the magic or the brand, the attractiveness um, lies in the dialogue between recruitment, hiring managers and candidates or leads. Um, that means that our employer branding is a lot more within the processes than outside. Because for us, that's the crucial point. Um, if, you, if you say, hey, I'm interested or I want to apply, that's the point where the magic has to begin. And so I guess it, it sounds like you're focusing much more on the real job than right. on the employer brand of, of the company. Um, and, and so, for instance, to make it a bit more tangible and give mm -hmm. some examples, um, what are the arguments that you put mm -hmm. in front of the job to uh, mm -hmm. really um, excite candidates to join MedBase? Yeah, we, we already talked about demands and um, important is not to tell the people just what you offer, but that you are, have the opportunity to listen and find the solutions that possibly best fit for the candidate as a career opportunity. That means we don't try to sell jobs, we look in a lot of uh, uh, um, sales or marketing methods and instruments because we think recruiters need a much bigger toolbox but what does it mean for us we don't offer vacancy or a job and say hey we need a lot of applicants to fill that vacancy uh, we do kind of reverse recruitment recruitment that means um, we try to get a very individual perspective and have an a lot of job opportunities for one candidate. Mm -hmm. That means we focus on job profiles and not on vacancy. For example, if you are a pharmacist, um, you give us your lead just with the basic information. Do you have approbation? Um, are you uh, able to speak German? And one or two more information, that's it. Um, no documents at all. And then we have an automated, scheduled first telephone call with a recruiter and um, trying to find the right environment in our job landscape um, for the candidate. That means, hey, uh, what do you want? Do you want to build a house for your family? Um, take a look on our uh, job opportunities in eastern Switzerland because um, buying a house is much more cheaper over there. Or do you want to have a, a leadership career? Um, okay, that means next year we will have an opportunity um, for um, a, leadership role, a leadership role in St. Gallen, for example, that you did not know before uh, when you take a look on our vacancies. And that means to find better solutions uh, for our candidates. It's more or less a kind of recruitment consulting. So Florian, as you know, we have uh, also launched now a candidate experience platform. We offer, I mean, many different products, but we have now combined them all into one platform. Mm -hmm. And what is the true benefit that you see behind uh, working with a platform? Yeah, I, I would call uh, the platform um, an ecosystem. That means for us, we can build a very, very um, yeah, uh, living recruitment ecosystem. That means we can um, start from leads into candidates, into um, yeah, new colleagues, but also means like um, it's very sustainable for us. Um, if you don't uh, uh, hire right now, you could be a hire in the future. If you are not a hire at all, you could be a part of our peer group network. That means we can connect you in a very um, informational way uh, with, uh, with our colleagues over there that have a lot of experience and always looking for an exchange. So um, yeah, you will, can we always be part from MedBase and grow with us and build a relationship just from the start. So you really make use of, I would say, the toolbox that we create by, yes. with you know all the different um, things that we combine into one platform. Maybe can you give uh, two examples of how you have been working, uh, you know, with that how you name it ecosystem of different tools and how uh, they created a combined value for you? 
yeah like you said that that, that kind of combination mm -hmm. is very useful for us you have a whole platform a whole ecosystem but can also uh, always find the, the solution you need or that the candidates might prefer um, just one um, example very concrete is a Facebook campaigning um, people in the in the medical sector are always complaining hey we don't find candidates anymore we don't have enough applicants and um, for us it was a very good opportunity to starting social advertising on Facebook very very uh, lean um, lead uh, advertising so we just uh, got uh, three or four information about the applicants um, the leads um, with the lead forms from clever connect went directly into the CRM in the CRM there was an automation, uh, a mail or message automation, so we could automatically um, schedule an appointment with a candidate and first interview. That means a lot of time saving for the recruiters because you have to imagine we found 100 leads for pharmacists within a week for 1,500 euros on Facebook advertising and uh, now try to have um, 150 or 100 appointments um, between recruiter and candidate, it's almost impossible. That you helped us a lot. And the next steps, you have a new automation again. That means you have a new form. Hey, candidate, it's been a pleasure. We need some more information for you from you. Therefore, our, for your forms helped us a lot again. And um, you can give always the right information at the right time. Okay, yeah, I think that's great, like really pointing out the combination of, of a very individualized form right. where you can increase the conversion because right. you just ask for a few relevant fields, right. but then making sure that over time, through automation, you collect more and more data that is even like personalizing the profile more. Um, and I think like you also said, the benefit is uh, that you're actually also recycling uh, candidates, right? So it's very sustainable because you are not, uh, you know, you don't need to generate many, many more candidates in the future once your database is, you know, filled with uh, very relevant profiles and then it's probably more about nurturing. Do you have a nurturing concept in place? Yeah, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> and, 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 and what are the things that you push? Is it more the job? Uh, or, or what kind of content are you pushing to the candidates? Um, on one hand, it's the jobs, sure, because um, also in, in, in medical or in pharmacist that's, uh, who's not working for us can also uh, do a referral for us if he says, hey, okay, um, the opportunity didn't fit for me, but maybe for one of my colleagues because he wants to move to Zurich, St. Gallen, etc. Um, so we give incentives even for people not working for us. So we're opening our referral ecosystem. And the second thing is, I would say, people um, are always interested in exchange with colleagues. So we uh, put another focus on um, employee advocacy, um, connecting people um, to make an exchange possible on topics they are interested in or even give them the uh, opportunity to share content that's relevant for them. How has Clever Connect supported you to master that change? Mm -hmm. uh, in many different ways. Um, like I told before, um, for us it's very important to have a system with a lot of opportunities to build processes that helps us in our strategy, not building a strategy around the system. That's the first step. You helped us there a lot because we you have been very, very um, solution oriented and that was a, was a very, very, very big asset. Uh, Appreciate it very much. Thank you. <laughs> and. Um, what we need to have is, like I said, a mix of automation and relevant information and therefore the CRM helps us a lot. Um, the CRM helps us a lot with APIs and new environments because, to be honest, um, job offers or job ads doesn't help us anymore. We still have them, but on a very base level. That means we uh, need to have better approaches. The more passive a market is, the more proactive we um, have to be. That means we have an, uh, social advertising campaigns right into your CRM. We have an sourcing activities with your broader extension right into the system and um, have a 
for sure a lot of information that we give and take and therefore um, Clever Connect also helps us with interpreting or analyzing um, the data we get from the candidates to find the best possible matches. Th your favorite three product features of Clever Connect? Just three. <laughs> the CRM, um, referral, another very important channel for us because I think um, if you are um, having a strategy with relationship building, that means that the foundation of all of it is um, referral, knowing people who could fit for the job. And the third one is um, the lead forms. Form. Okay, so that candidates can very easily, right. and also what you mentioned that it's very adjustable, right? Because you yes. said you have like depending on the job requirement, there are just a few different questions that you want to adapt, but you want to keep it as simple as possible to increase uh, uh, the conversion. And and last but not least, can you maybe share some stories from your your teams? I would be interested to uh, to hear how has your team perceived that change, and and can you share some anecdotes uh, from your teams? Yeah, sure. Um, just a story from yesterday evening. Um, the good thing about Clever Connect is it's easy to use, so it's a very easy but therefore safe. Um, environment uh, to implement a new or even complex new systems and um, a re recruitment colleague from me from my team uh, told me yesterday evening hey do you know if I if I uh, can can um, add some um, some new forms over here he didn't find it on the first step and the funny thing was I just wrote him yes you can and he answered me two minutes later Hey, it was so fun uh, to try it out. I just found it. Great. No, I mean, that's also our ambition at Clever Connect, obviously, to make it as simple as possible. Yes. Because we believe that true change can only happen when the people who use it are actually, you know, love to using the technology and don't always try to hide away from it. So uh, I'm, I'm happy that we are following on that, uh, on that promise. And uh, it was great to meet you here, Florian. My pleasure, Carl. Looking forward to the next steps.